Hi, I'm Casey Macbeth. I'm the writer and director of the Army 2 film that we're putting together right now. Uh, we're on day two. Lots of special effects and stunts that have come along really well. Now we just need to finish up what makes it an actual story. So thanks again for all the support and stay tuned for more special behind the scenes footage. I've always actually been quite passionate about the Army of Two series. Um, when it first came out, I mean, the first commercial caught me, it was a great idea. And then just the way they were putting together the action and kind of that camaraderie between each other, it, it was something that always stuck out of me. Hanging out here on uh, Army of Two, playing Bradley. This is every like kid's dream come true. I mean, this is what I'm doing for my job right now. Is I'm running around with assault rifles, throwing grenades. Guys are running around on fire, especially for my generation. It's G.I. Joe all grown up. Hi, I'm Scott Levy, and I play Pike in Army of Two, The Devil's Cartel. I play that part in the video game. Uh, working on set here has been fantastic. Everybody has come together as an amazing team and done a fantastic job. In fact, I was just watching some of the dailies. They're cutting them together because, as you know, we're on a crunch because we have to get this out to coincide with the release of the game on the 26th, I believe. So it's crunch time. The journey here has been quite, quite uh, challenging. We had a lot of issues that, you know, dropped on us. And, but, you know, it's one of those things where you just got to keep trying and uh, keep working at it. When you're working with fan films, the one thing you don't want to do is pee off the fans. And it's hard, too, because not everyone has the same taste. And uh, that was one thing we really wanted to hold true with the uh, whole fan film in itself, is just kind of stay true to like the characters, maybe give them some backstory, uh, make it into something live action, because I'm sure there's fans out there who want to see this into an actual feature. Uh, I'm uh, Lane Levitt. I'm a stuntman, stunt coordinator. Uh, I set up the fire burn today. We had a awesome time. Um, my only complaint is I wanted to do it at night so we had more glow and more fire so we just glued him up a bunch and unfortunately in the daytime this is the bright sun takes away some of the magic but uh, we're really happy with how it went. We burned him twice. The second time we put a little more fuel on but I think both burns were awesome. At the beginning of the fueling process it takes me about a minute to fuel him. Then I will uh, light him. He won't know he's lit until I tell him he's lit. Then I'll say you're lit, and he goes off and does his choreography. Hi, my name is Mason Sherrill. I'm one of the stunt performers for the Army of Two live action that we're shooting today. Uh, I was the uh, stunt performer that got set on fire. We did a full body burn today. Uh, it was about a 15 second burn, and uh, it was a lot of fun. The physical training for stunts, you are constantly training. You have to be versed in martial arts, tricking, parkour, fire burns. You need to be versatile in to really be a good stunt performer. I was lucky enough to have Lane Levitt come out and uh, help me out with this burn. He's been doing stunts for the last 30, 40 years. I am the armorer and the second assistant director. My job basically is to make sure that all of the actors have all of the guns that they're supposed to have when they're supposed to have them keep track of the continuity between magazines and actors and guns, and make sure everyone knows how to use them the correct way you would use an actual firearm. I love being on set. I, I definitely have the best job. I get to play with guns, chat with the actors, chat with the crew about guns all day long. What more could you want? Um, I'd like to give a quick shout out to evic.com who supplied us with all of the guns. They came through in flying colors. They really hooked us up. Big thanks to all the guys at evic.com.